roll. Probably just gotta get freaky for you because you love the hoes. <laughs> I don't care if they don't like me. I came here to stunt. Yeah, yeah. I don't care if they don't. I'm gonna make this quick. This is for y'all dudes that know y'all got that good work. Like y'all know. Her hair is beautiful, by the way. Y'all know. Y'all got that work. Like y'all be so cocky and arrogant with like y'all know I'm finna flatten your tires about this work. Y'all know I'm finna square y'all grandmoms up about this work. Y'all know I'm finna go to jail and get active about this work. But why? Why do y'all do this shit y'all do? What goes on? Y'all know <laughs> But you know what's crazy? She might be making a joke out of this, but women actually go to the extents of doing this. And you know what's crazy? I saw a video not too not too long ago. Beautiful black woman, right? Beautiful. And this beautiful butterscotch black woman out here saying that if you give her the good D and you have her going crazy in the bedroom, what makes you think that you're not her man? If we fuck raw, what makes you think you're not my man? What makes you think you're not my boyfriend? What makes you think we don't go together? Like, what makes you think these things? Because if we f*** you're my man, and that's no discussion. Yeah, you heard what Boogie said. When it comes to the depths of, of sex, and in some cases, some of these some of these women, you just cannot give good dingling to. Or, or give it at all. If you ever have a woman, you talking with them, you find an attraction for her, y'all might be flirting a little bit, and then all of a sudden she talks about how, you know, if... If if you if you if you give me and you put me in this position or if you have me me going crazy you have my body spazzing we together. Well, what makes you think you can go in and do another girl like this and all this type of stuff, right? I've had girls tell me that if you give me the good D, and we just laying in bed, I'm about to be really thinking in the back of my head how many other women have he done like this, and then. Where you think you're going? Back to my life? What are you talking about? Nah, you mind now. This stuff is crazy. I'm beginning to see why some of these women out here dressing like Chucky because a lot of y'all just crazy. Some of y'all are psychopathic. And y'all need psychological evaluation. It makes no sense how some of these women claim they're so more mature than, than men. They're so much more mature than men. They they can they can handle their emotions better. They can talk better. They can they can all this type of stuff. You ever hear women talk about this? <laughs> so much more emotionally in alignment with their emotions. So much more emotionally intelligent. They they mature faster and all this other type of stuff. And they get digmatized like that. They get emotional like that. Why are you treat me like that? I feel like you. Y'all, y'all clearly made an exchange for your poom poom for his dingaling, and somehow you crying yourself at night because y'all have made it very well known that y'all are dress messing with each other because y'all might have a friendship here and there, and for the sex, and yet you sit in bed <laughs> making yourself annoyed can't sleep at night because you feel like you're a hoe because you feel like you're a 304 but what's wrong with that <laughs> now i know that might be a little controversial so we'll, we'll 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 back it down a little bit when it comes to you being in a relationship with another dude or when it comes to you having this exchange with another dude and y'all made it very well and very well known that y'all just have this relationship now it gets to the point where you might be catching feelings. Man, just just beating the doonies up, just blowing the back out. Just got your 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 back your back out here. He he got your back. He got your back looking like this. Like he just bam, 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 bam. He over here just just grabbing the neck. He over here pulling your hair. Bang, 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 bang. You having flashbacks. Twelve o'clock in the afternoon while you at work. It's, it's ridiculous. And now you over here like, why won't he cuff me? Why won't he be in a relationship with me? Because y'all have exchanged or, or y'all made it very well known in the beginning what the relationship was going to be like. 
Now, sometimes it might work out. Y'all might be in a relationship, whatever the case may be. But if the man intentions was just for getting some poom poom, you can't expect more from that. You know, I always have this conversation with a, a good couple of, of women when it concerns the basis of being sexually expressive and sexually free. Some women out here have gotten the memo of what it means to be sexually expressive, right? Some women out here, they want to be a 304, but they want to be a, a clean and a classy 304. Do so. You know how many classy 304s there are out here without using the word 304? You know how many women out here just, just masquerade themselves as this beautiful angel, innocent, just ew, sick. I don't even think about that. Ew, I don't even touch myself. And they would just be the nastiest. I guarantee you. The women. And <laughs> fellas y'all can attest to this. But the most freakiest women. Aren't the women out here. Shaking ass on Instagram. It's the ones with the cute little. Church dress and all the. With the cross around their neck. That's the demon. <laughs> that's the demon. That's the succubus. But we'll save that conversation for another time. For another day. Point is, a lot of women don't know their own potential and their own power to the point where they can live their best life. You know, they can get as much dingling as they so desire and still play it classy, still be clean, still take care of their health. They won't be, just be letting, don't let anybody just up in there. All right. I ain't saying all that <laughs> getting ran through, but you have the potential to know your own power and live the way that you want to live to embody that archetype of being the 304 you know and I, I talk about this in my exclusive content concerning the basis of the you know the divine archetype of the heart all right so y'all want to know more about that y'all become a fan or y'all become a, a member and y'all get that information but you do have women out here who are a bit insecure you know when it concerns the basis of having their back blown out by more than one man you have a lot of women out here who feel like they're going to be judged because let's just be honest in this world. If a man, you know, sluts out five, six women in one month, he gets the daps up. He gets called the pimp, the Mac. Oh, he get, he get all the women, all this type of stuff. Right. People look up to him. But if a woman does the same thing within a month and we're just going to be honest, people are going to side eye her. People are going to overlook her. If her body count is a little too high, but it's the woman that might have the most body count that might be the most sincere, that might be the might be the most down to heart, might have the most the most potential. But you'll overlook her because of her past. This is the Mary Magdalene story, you know, with Jesus. Jesus loved a 304. Most of the women that he was around was a 304. His mother was a 304. But that's for the Gnosticism content. We'll save her that for the exclusive. <laughs> Jesus loved the 304. Shiva, he loved the 304. Papa Legba loves the 304s. I'm just, I'm just keeping it real. Ask Pampa Jira. That's my girl. <laughs> well, let me know how you feel about this personally in the comment section below. All right. When it concerns the basis of, you know, giving the ping ping to some of these women out here. You know, let me share your thoughts, fellas. Ladies, share your comments as well in the comment section below respectfully. All right. And before you go, check out these other videos. Hey. Long as I got God, black women and the squad.